Next, uh, Anissa Kamaldi uh, Costa, president of the Tiffany and Company Foundation, and she's going to say a few words. Anissa. Thank you, Mr. Mayor. The High Line, with its unique history and design that's inspired by nature, truly reflects the Tiffany & Company Foundation's dedication to creating beautiful urban spaces that can be cherished for generations to come. Parks really are the natural treasures in our cities, playing an essential role in the urban landscape. And the Tiffany & Company Foundation is so proud to support organizations like Friends of the High Line that create, beautify, and transform public urban green spaces around the world. So when Friends of the High Line asked us to jumpstart an effort to help make this day possible, we knew it was an opportunity to help make something incredible happen. In 2011, the Tiffany & Company Foundation made a $5 million challenge grant to help secure the future of the park, including the rail yards. The leadership of Friends of the High Line and its longstanding supporters, ranging from philanthropy and government to real estate and transportation really made what once seemed like an impossible dream a reality. Tiffany & Company just celebrated its 175th anniversary recently. So from one historic New York icon to a new one, the High Line 2 has developed its own legacy to be celebrated. On behalf of everyone at Tiffany & Company, I just want to express my pleasure and great pride in being part of this historic and momentous occasion.